You say hello to them. Okay. Hello! <laughs> Alona? Alona. Mason? Mason? Oh, that's interesting. So, Mardi Gras. We are at Mardi Gras, which is a seasonal thing here at Escape Countdown in Tampa, Florida. Um, we just did it. It is a very cool concept. It's a two person room. So rather than the big eight, you know, where you go in and you're probably, you have to look for friends to do the group together, you can do this and be perfectly equipped to handle the puzzles with two people, right? Right, correct. Right. So the story here is that um, you got an hour to research, get a lot of history, so on and so forth, because if you can do this, if you can figure out all the puzzles, because puzzles for some odd reason are prerequisite to partying hard, you will be the first person on the party float at uh, the Mardi Gras, right? The first parade float? Yeah. Yeah. So we really wanted that honor because that was a big deal for us. Yeah. Like we wanted to be the first person there. And we've got a lot of liquor ready for that to happen. So what are you doing with the Nothing, nothing, nothing. I'm just kidding. You're just wrecking the place, just, you know. Yeah. Yeah. Well, right. So that's the story. Um, what did you think of the decoration? Oh, I love it. It's beautiful. It's beautiful? Yeah, like me. Just just like that. Mm -hmm. I don't think we need to go further than her just streaking her hand across the wall. I think that covers like everything. I think they just can hire me to do that. They can just hire. So they would hire you to just walk into rooms and streak the wall? Of maybe... course, because her room is beautiful. I'm beautiful, so. That's lovely. I know. Okay, so getting off that humble cloud nine that we're on. Um, now, as you can see, it's very well done for Mardi Gras. Uh, it's got a very Louisiana theme. There's even a map that kind of um, takes you through some of the locations. And, you know, yeah, you definitely feel like even, even, even the luggage and so on and so forth, the things that you're opening definitely kind of feels very Mardi Gras-esque. Um, I can't say exactly what it was, but they had awesome. one lock mechanism that I've never seen before, and it fits so well with the theme. I was geeking out pretty hard about it. Okay. Okay, you know what I'm talking about, right? Um, uh, what did you uh, say? Uh, was it, uh, okay. You want to do that thing where you're like, oh, you mean this? And then I'm like, <laughs> no, woman! But we're not going to go there this time. All right. Because my pimp hand is really not, not feeling it today. Okay. Okay. Um, All the puzzles flowing good. It did flow. The puzzles flowed fantastically. Actually, it was, it was moving. Like we usually have to do the rooms with two, the eight person rooms with two of us. So and, and we either get out or we barely get out. You know, because once again, competency level not the highest. But for this room, you know, it was two person room, and we we were in our element. We were feeling good, and we we went through it pretty well actually. Like after doing their Mad Hatter experiences and then just losing brain cells while looking at the <laughs> single thing over and over, just realizing we're deteriorating, like we're de-evolving as we go through the room just because we couldn't figure this one thing out. And doing this, it's refreshing. Like we felt like we were flowing really good. Everything made a lot of sense. Um, as far as uh, cr like constructive criticism, not too much, actually. I, I really can't find too many things to be annoyed about. I mean, I really, really dug it overall. And I, I really like the concept of a two-person room. I think a lot of escape game owners, uh, if they have a very low footage or low square footage, mm -hmm. they could go for something like that. Right. Um, but overall, um, really like the Mardi Gras room. This is usually an evening in Paris. Uh, this room is, but, you know, Mardi Gras, so on and so forth, time of year. But, um, but yeah, so Mardi Gras, totally dug it. Do you have anything else to say? No, it's just fantastic. Just fantastic? Yeah. Okay, well, fair enough. What? What are you doing? Are oh, you hungry? <laughs> what the hell? I just keep thinking nothing else. I just thinking about food. I'm sorry. What is <laughs> That is so staying in this video. Like, Alona loses her stuff. She's like, well, that's a nice... Oh! She just turns into a zombie that just wants food. Chinese specifically. But, <laughs> calm down. Calm down. I tried. <laughs> but, Sugar is too low. just calm down. Mardi Gras, Escape Countdown. Alona. Tampa, Florida. And I am Mason. And we are out.